So like me, there are a lot of fans out there who are very excited about this new doll, and that's who I'm going to unbox and review in this video, and that is Romance in the Air, Augustus Blake from the East 59th Street Collection. Now, part of the reason why people are so excited is this uses the Darius 1.0 sculpt, which had been retired previously by Integrity Toys, but it's been back brought back out of retirement and now is a part of the East 59th Collection. So without further ado, let's take a look at this doll. So this is the shipper for Romance in the Air, Augustus Gus Blake fashion figure, part of the East 59th Collection. So let's see if we can get the shipper open. And as you see, it's got the nice little tissue paper in there. And I'm going to fold this back to see if we can get this doll out. And whoa, this came out like perfectly. Look at this box. It's absolutely beautiful. And of course, I have it upside down. <laughs> but look, it looks just as beautiful this way too. <laughs> so anyway, look at that beautiful box for the East 59th collection. I'm going to try to not drop my... Okay, I just dropped everything over there. You didn't hear that. I will delete that in post, right? That's what they say, in post. So anyway, take a look at this box. It's got the beautiful branding here. And of course, it's got the East 59th logo and the East 59th logo again. Also information about not choking on your doll and information on the Integrity Toys website, www.integritytoys.com. They did not pay me for that plug. That was free. So anyway, let's take a look at the doll within. And one of the things I love about this box is of course the theatrical doors. So without further ado, let's take a look at, oh, Oh, wow, he is beautiful. I'm not even, oh my God, he's really beautiful. Look at this. I'm going to see if I can go in a little bit. I am going freehand here, and let's take a look at the doll. I love that they've got his hair protected with this net here, and look at the details on this suit. And I'm wondering, is this a shirt too? Yeah, actually, I wonder, yeah, I have lots of questions. And you've got the big giant goodie box of accessories and things. And look, he even has white socks. And are those little cuffs down there? Okay, this is what I am going to do, because obviously I am hypnotized. I am going to get him out of this box so that we can take a closer look at this doll, his outfit, and all of his accessories. So here is a close-up of Romance in the Air, Augustus Gus Blake, part of the East 59th collection. The head sculpt is the long-awaited return of the Darius 1.0 sculpt. So let's just take it in for all its gloriousness from the side profile as well. His skin tone is listed as FR Black, and his hair color is listed as Black. And as you can see, it's got those beautiful textured curls there, and let's see if we can go in a little bit closer. Look at that. Very beautiful and very soft. And let's just take him in. I am just so happy to see him back. Just to pull back just a little bit so that we can see the outfit and his body. He is on the Ohm 1.5 body, which is a great body. I mean, he doesn't have a, a, a yeah, he doesn't have one of those. <laughs> so anyway, you can see he's got this beautiful tailored suit here with this beautiful plaid pattern. I'm going to go in so that you could see the beautiful detail of the outfit. This is not cheap material here. And you can see it's really tailored to his body. And you can see the 
button detail, but of course we know that these are not real buttons. These are actually the little latches here. The buttons are decorative and we love them because they're just so beautiful. And as you can see, he's got a tie underneath and it looks like, yep, it's just comes off. I don't have to tie anything. Thank goodness. It just, it's just gonna come on and off with this elastic waist. And I'm just gonna pull this off and actually I'm going to remove his hands so that it'll just be easier. Oh, maybe it's not so easy to remove these. Ooh, he's not, oh, he is resisting. So what I'm going to do when a doll resists, I listen. So as you can see, it's got this full shirt here and let's, you know what? Okay, may I? Okay, see when you ask nicely, then the universe, may I? will open up things for you. Okay, may I? I paid for it. <laughs> it is not coming off. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to continue to show a little bit of patience and we can enjoy the detail of the outfit. You can see it also has that nice leather belt that does look like it's functional. And let's see the cuff of the shirt there. It does not open and close, which I actually like, so that you can just use that and put the hand on afterwards. And as you can see, it also has that beautiful IT label on there. So I'm gonna try again with this hand and hopefully it will be nice to me and not break. Ah, there we go. If you just show a little patience, it will come off and as you can see, the detail inside of the jacket and the lining. This is really high quality. They really did a great job paying attention to detail and really giving us high quality. So as you can see, it is a full shirt on this doll and these pants here. And it also has, as you can see here, the latch in order to open. And in fact, let's just do that and see. This is not salacious. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this open because I want to see if the shirt is like how it's if it's long or something. So let's remove the latch here. Did I get the latch? I got the latch. Oh, and look, it has a little zipper there. And the shirt is a very long shirt, as you can see, that tucks in to the trousers or slacks here. So, and let's see, see, as I said, he does not have anything. This is an Ohm 1.5 body. So the shirt does come on and off with, again, these latches here, and so does the tie with this little easy elastic band. Very easy, thank you very much for keeping it that way. But that's not all that he comes with. Romance in the Air Augustus Gus Blake also comes with this really cute pair of wingtip shoes, as you can see. Look at the detail on here. He also comes with another set of pants, as you can see here. And look at this. It's got the nice zipper and latch detail there, and it's got the nice cuffs. It looks very tailored as well. And he also comes with this really pretty sweater vest. So it's very cute, but we're not done yet. He also comes with this display stand here with the East 59th logo. As you can see, it has the little rod and the other black part, which would support him. One thing I also forgot to mention is that he does come wearing a pair of socks and also in looking at the socks you can see also the cuff detail of the pants i mean that's just really really detailed but i'm not done yet he also comes with a certificate of authenticity and this one shows that i have number ooh, 138 of 550 which means there are 550 of this doll floating out there worldwide so because Romance in the Air, Augustus Gus Blake, comes with so many accessories and really 
two different outfits. What I am going to do, I'd like to do 360 looks on both of those outfits and looks with the accessories so that we could take a look at what they actually look like when they're all put together. So I want to make a quick note on the pants for this doll. It looks like they are a combination of the latch and also Velcro. So I'm redressing and I'm seeing that on both pair of pants. So it's got the latch and Velcro, not a zipper. Not a bad thing, but just something I did want to point out to you in case you were surprised when you got your own. So here is Romance in the Air, Augustus Blake in his first look. I know he comes with two outfits, but actually because you can mix and match, you can actually come up with different looks. So this is look number one. So let's do a 360 of the first look. As you can see, I put the alternate pair of pants that came with him. I also put on the vest over the white shirt. And let's go in closer. You can see the detail on the dolls. You can see he's got the curly hair and he also has flocking where the curly hair is not. Let's let you take a look at that. And then let's take a look at the detail in the outfit. Let's see, he's got the sweater vest. I suggest you put the head on first because it was really difficult otherwise. <laughs> I tried. Learn from me. Don't be like Miss Sophia over here. <laughs> so anyway, let's take a closer look at those really cool shoes. Beautiful. The cuff on the pants. And of course, this is the first look. Here we have a second look for Romance in the Air, Augustus Blake. So here I have the alternate pants on. I also have the sweater, but I also included the suit jacket. So let's do a 360 of him in the second look. And you can see it's kind of a little bit dressed up, but still a little bit more casual than just the regular suit. Um, let's see what that looks like together. It matches really well together. As you can see the fabrics and the colors all blend in really well. And that is the second look for Romance in the Air, Augustus Blake. So here is Romance in the Air, Augustus Blake in his third look, which is the tailored period inspired plaid suit. So let's do a 360 on this. So as you can see, the suit is really tailored really well to the body here. And you can see it from all angles very quality material as well so let's take a look at our doll in his suit very handsome and you can see it's more close detail of the suit there that's quality material and of course you can see the tie right there and the buttons detail also thank you to the designer for making the bottom of the pants open enough so that I can actually put the shoes on with both uh, pants I don't have to remove the shoes so look at that pocket detail too very nice And that is our third look. All right, I would like to welcome our panel. First, we have fashion icon and first lady of Mattel, Silkstone Barbie. 
Next we have Top Advertising Genius Modeling Agent and the Eternal Bachelor, Laird Dre. Oh, Laird, you have a note for us. I just haven't met the right girl. Aww. Oh, Laird. <laughs> and last but certainly not least, actress, model, singer, Alyssa Rodriguez. So Barbie, what are your thoughts on Romance in the Air, Augustus Blake? Oh, you have a note. You said, he's very handsome. Well, you know what, Barbie, I would have to agree with you. And Laird, what are your, th Laird? OMG, did true love just prevail today? Alyssa, I see you have a note for me. Did I just lose both guys? I'm afraid so, Alyssa. Better luck next time. <laughs> All right, well, um, thank you, panel. <laughs> So I am super impressed with Romance in the Air, Augustus Blake from the East 59th Street collection. Number one, I do love the romance storyline with Laird, and I love the salacious part of it all, of course. Um, but otherwise, I really am so happy to see the return of the Darius 1.0 sculpt like a lot of collectors this was one that we missed and so it's so awesome to see him back that being said you also with this doll you get a lot of outfit options that are really well made high quality pieces my suggestion to you is to get your hands on this doll and all that he comes with because this is absolutely Fabulous. Great job to Chris Deckel. He's the designer of this co entire collection. I did an interview with him when this line was first announced, and I was so excited I just had to talk to him. So I have a link to that interview below, somewhere in the comments or somewhere below. You'll find the link to that interview. It's really good, really worth checking out. It gives you insight into this line. So check that out. So anyway, if you like this video, and I hope that you did, then please make sure that you click the like button. That's how I know that you like my videos. Also, have you subscribed? Have you subscribed to this channel? I hope you have, because if you do, you'll get notified of when I come up with new videos just like this one. Subscribe now, make a brother happy. So anyway, thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day.